Oh, hello, hello, it's me, Man 47 here, and today we're going to be playing Rodeo Stampede Sky Zoo. I know that this may just come off as me going quickly into a video, but I've been playing this game a lot. The reason that I started here instead of the title screen is because what I'm going to be doing in this episode is I'm going to be trying to catch the Electro Zebra. You can see it down there. I just ran into something, I don't know what I ran into, but I ran into something, and I ran out of skips or whatever, continues, so, but I did, but I don't think I got that salt in the hat, gee, look at the zoo, this game, it's, um, you get dropped off in an area, and I have to go quickly just, of all these ones, I'll explain it to you in a moment. But right now, I'm trying to get it, the Electro Zebra, and I don't want to waste my 200% more rare animals thing. So I'm wondering why this will be the only rhino you're going to see, at least in this area. It's because I need to do, I need to ra run into um things and smash them for a challenge. Yeah, and if you start playing this game and you're wondering why I have lost stuff or anything, I have a lot of my stuff up. Like, I have my buffalo and zebras maxed out. So buffaloes are what I'm riding now. And yes, there are different rare versions. And I have pretty much all buffaloes except a um special one that you had to buy for an event. But one thing you want to know is if you begin in playing this game, you want to level your buffaloes up to the point where they, when you land on them, they do a ram thing. Because otherwise, they're not very good. With the ram thing, they can do pretty good stuff. Okay. Near the point where it should be spawning. Just gotta hope I get lucky. And on this. Okay. Come on. Got to be able to find it. Or well, not. Not this round. No time. So this ad. Sorry about all the ads. This game has a lot of ads. And that's another mission complete. I'll get some money from that. And then I'll only be three more missions that I need to complete to get to the next area and start finding two cans. Heh. <laughs> Also, if you're going to be riding an ostrich like I'm riding now, it's one of the first animals you get access to. There's an upgrade that when you keep holding onto it and it starts going quickly, if you run into something, it throws you, which is really good. It saves me multiple times. Boost. But I've unlocked... Nearly every animal. Well, I've unlocked all the base animals. Like, the base species, but not at the special versions of them. For those, I've unlocked all the buffalo ones. And then, there's two zebra ones I need. One of the zebra ones is the one that I'm hunting right now. The other zebra one is um, one that you have to wait for a certain day because there's an endangered animal thing or like each day there's a special animal that you have to go out and try to find. The zebra one only spawns every so often. So, yeah. Also, you're going to be seeing this 
thing a lot. I just run till I get eight. And you know, because pretty much memorize this, because <coughs> I play it so much. Let me take you through my sky zoo real quick. And that's four hundred dollars. Continue zoo. Is it later? Let me take you through the zoo. Now. The max level is level 9, and you can see 9909 Buffalo Tamed. Let me show you the Buffalo. Um, hold on. Get, they mix it around. Cape okay, Buffalo. Then uh, you get the Forest Buffalo, Water Buffalo, Curruffalo, Buffari. Buffari, you have to get to level 9. Dial Buffalo. It's a secret one. You have to ride one Buffalo for 750 meters. Buffalo BQ, you have to buy it during this event. Bison, and then buff the magic dragon. Now this one is a real rare one. As you can see that I haven't been able to, I have these ones, I haven't unlocked their areas, but this one I, I'll unlock its area eventually. But I already have gone all these and this one, this one, and this one weren't hard. This one, and this one were extremely hard. What do I need to do right now? Oh, I'm gonna go over this way to the dino area. It is a pretty good place. Get you some good stuff. As you can see, I actually have of three of these, the Paracephalosaurus, the Crobarophorus, the Metallocephalosaurus. Yes, I know I butchered those names. I don't really care. Go through the portal. Now this one you have to get pretty far in the game to get to. Let's see, need to ride. It's two. Collect the egg. Darn it. Yeah, I know that I just unlocked T-Rex with my last upgrade. Oh, come on. Right now I have my sense I have my sensitivity usually turned up really high because you usually want to turn it up in the settings because Otherwise, you can move your hand from the left of the screen all the way to the right, and barely anything happens. Come on, get a bit closer. No, 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 no. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. That's good. Then I have to ride raptors and collect eggs. Eventually when you get far enough to a point like this, eventually asteroids are going to start falling down. There was one right there. Got the T-Rex. Quick boost. Well, you have to be very careful, and also, the farther you go, the more likely chance of things landing on you. Darn it. But, yeah, in the um, Jurassic, to upgrade anything, you don't use money. What you need to do is you have to complete the missions. There's always boss missions where they come around every once in a while and you unlock a free boss animal. Although those missions can be hard. They're not too ter they're not too terribly hard. But they're still hard to the point 
I'm just gonna need a few tries to get them. Like, there's the skeleton elephant, the skeleton. That one, you need to ride in a place that has a bunch of buffalo, a few lions, and a few vultures. And there you need to, um, oh, what's it called? Yeah, you need to get fur far enough to catch, catch it, which it's pretty far in. And if you see that little dinosaur, f I mean, little elephant following me, eventually... I don't know exactly what point you get it at, but eventually at a point you could, um, and you could, if you, you find an animal that you, you have to tame it pretty much. And once you tame it, it, it will, um, at the end of the run, you are allowed to start breeding it. And once it's bred, you get a free little pet that gives you different ones. Like, the one that I have right now is one of the best pets I have because it, it it's 6% more rare animals, which is great. It's one of the best things I... It's the best one I have, pretty much. Okay. You know, the sensitivity turned up, It that's what's actually making it so that I can actually move these. Otherwise, it's like my hand all the way, it goes like that. Much barely moving at all. Might turn my sensitivity up even more. Because with my sensitivity like this, I'm much better at the game. If my sensitivity is too low, it makes it so hard for me to play. But, so now I'm done, now I just have to ride raptors. I'm gonna go back to the zoo. So I can add every, almost every time you leave. That's not very good. Okay, let's see. Alright, I almost forgot. I have the baby Velociraptor. Jump from animals 6% faster. Huh. That's cute. If you go here, if you can throw raptors in the stampede, add two new rare raptors to the stampede, and a bunch of other stuff. Right here, I have, I have it level 1. First, I, want, I need to level this one up. Don't throw raptors in the stampede. And three times. And I'm hoping to get. Because here, this one, it's easy. This one is just one rare one that you have to find. This one you buy you buy with this event. Here I'm going to have to Catch its special version. Catch its special version, its special version. But, I need to do this one first. The farther you go, the more energy it drains, but it barely drains any energy, so don't be afraid to go very far. I must ask, does anyone out there in YouTube land, I guess you could say, 
eat, um, have heartburn. I know that I do. So, not a very well known fact about me. But sometimes I feel like my I, the inside of my throat is burning. Doesn't debilitate me or anything like that. Yes, this is exactly what I was looking for. The floss, the flossoraptor. <laughs> I would not want this thing going anywhere near my teeth. Okay, now this part thing right here looks really weird. Someone should post this. Someone should post this picture on the internet somewhere. And then ask people to guess what's happening. Oh yes, and I must mention there is a volcano in the background. I'm very glad that I caught this. But as you saw that, the um, things are getting more aggressive. Get over here. Let's see. Retry. You know, I've seen this one before, and the person doing this is just dumb. Now this is just, this would be so easy. I see him as like, are you mentally retarded, man? Because easy is going, okay. That wasn't correct. Never mind. I mean, not. It was correct, but it's being a meanie and not a real playable ad. I hate it when ads do that. Don't you go? Don't you? And yes, I'm talking to you, Nate. <laughs> Anyone named Nate? They probably just got pretty freaked out. I had the same thing happen to me once. I was just playing a, was playing a game. We're well, not playing the game. I was watching a YouTube video, and they said, "I know what you did." Insert name. And I was just like, "What?" <laughs> Audibly freaked out. Yes, that is good. Let's go to the zoo. Now this one I've seen it so many times. You put broccoli after this, then spinach leaves and overcooks it. And grates a bunch of cheese. It's horrid. Also, I do have the sounds turned off. Don't like the sounds for this game. Not very good. And I know this is a fake ad. The first time I had this ad, it tricked me. Never again, ad. Never again. Let's see. Three times more raptors. That's great. Okay, now what's my missions? Five obstacles. Okay, then just travel. Okay, I believe the main thing that I need to focus on is jumping over obstacles. You and I'll passively collect eggs. I believe I'm gonna need to use this if I want to jump over obstacles. There's two, five. Okay, I know that I could probably get two at a time. Don't accidentally click. Probably get two at a time if need be. Does that one work? Yes. So you need to angle it slightly more. Sometimes it takes a bit of trial and error to figure out which things that you can jump over, which things you can't. 
You know, if there's like a chain of five different things, that'd be very good. Yeah, there's a bunch of things for this. This game is an okay looking game. Comment down below if you want it posted. I mean, for me to play it. Okay. Sometimes I don't like that T-Rex. Also, the little shrubs on the ground don't count. See? Doesn't count. I've lost. Thanks, guys. Yep. I know I'm not actually mad. I played this game before. Okay. Nope. I For this... I want to make the biggest snowball possible. Come on. Huh. Couldn't make it any bigger because he ran straight into it. Okay. Choose jump. Okay, that was one. But then I crashed. <laughs> Ay, 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 ay. What? No, I'm not. Well, maybe I'll play it eventually. But it just. Uh, but it all depends on what you guys are, want me to play. Because I'm here for you. And you too, Chad. I know you watch every single one of my videos. And you can't prove me wrong. <laughs> yeah. I don't really have a care for this game. I'm gonna play this thing anyway. Just to prove people wrong who say that I cannot do it. Touch, hold, and escape. Come on. No, 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 no. Almost got eaten, then I jumped off the thing. Of course. Oh, fork. Oh, come on. You're a tricky thing. Game ads, they'll keep trying to get you. It's bad, but... Yeah. Never trust a game ad. Trust it one time, the first time you meet it, to see if it will actually give you the experience. Probably won't, but if it does, then you have to... Then, it's a good thing to keep doing it. So only the first two work. That wasn't an apple. Darn, I keep forgetting. Oh, I just realized the time. Gotta end the video here. Till next time. Bye.